Hey there, everyone. Let's start today's coverage of Class 3A action with one of Atoma's school record seven qualifiers. Alec Clark started the day off at 120 pounds. He got a nice win by fall in the first period against Keegan Schultzschick from Xavier Cedar Rapids. Clark will face Zach Price from Johnston tomorrow. At 145 pounds, Mount Pleasant's Colton Mertens advance. Mertens gets a takedown on Carroll Sam Castle and goes on to win 7-1 in his first state tournament match. Well, it's nice to get the extra time to recover, go back to the hotel, relax and whatnot, but we start getting ready for tomorrow. Mertens takes on Alec Kazak from Johnston in tomorrow's competition. Then at 182 pounds, Isaiah Cox with an impressive takedown on North Scott's Tristan Richardson. He went on to win 9-4 and started his tournament with a win, unlike last year when he lost in the first round. It feels really good, you know, uh, just coming out here and I um, like, compete and just like do my stuff that I wanted to do, you know. Not like last year, I, I, didn't, I didn't feel good competing at what I was competing at last year. Cox will see Jasmine Moore from Waverly Shell Rock in tomorrow's 3A quarterfinal match. It did not go well for Atoma's remaining five wrestlers in the constellations. At 126 pounds, junior Jonathan Morales was eliminated by Jacob Waters of Cedar Falls 7-3. Colin McConnell lost by the same score but in an extra period to Noah Carr of West Valley Des Moines. At 138 pounds, Justin Skinner lost a close 5-3 to three decision to Brock Parker of Waukee at 145 pounds. And then Wyatt Schotter lost 4-3 to three to Sean Brown of Des Moines Lincoln at 152 pounds. And lastly, Tyler Book and Nosvich fell by major decision to add Edwards of Des Moines North Hoover. The 3A quarterfinals start at 9 a.m. tomorrow.